Hello students, welcome to Engineers Academy. Uh, let's solve this particular problem from Hebelostatics. The problem says that the plate is suspended using three cables which exerts the force shown. Express each force as a Cartesian vector. So we have these three forces FBA, FCA and FTA. So we need to represent these forces as a Cartesian vector. Their magnitudes are given. So as we know that FBA the Cartesian vector will be equal to its magnitude FBA times the unit vector from B to A and its magnitude is given which is 350 pounds so we can write it directly so this is 350 pounds and as we know that the unit vectors from B to A will be equal to the position vector from B to A divided by its magnitude divided by the magnitude of the position vector so now as we know that we, we can find the position vector directly so we need to reach that point A from this point B uh, as we move along the positive x y and z axis so we need to find the distances along the positive along the x y and z axis right so now to reach that point A from this point B we need to move this distance first and this is 6 feet distance in the positive y direction right so I will write this as 350 and we need to move 6 feet in the positive y direction this is our positive y so I will write uh, plus 6 j then from here we need to move this distance and this distance is 3 plus 2 so this distance is 5 feet right so this is in the negative x direction so this means that we need to move 5 feet in the negative i direction and then from here we need to move 14 feet distance in the positive z direction so i will write plus 14 k so this is the position vector from b to a and now we need to divide it by its magnitude so the magnitude we can find the magnitude by taking the squares of these components and then taking the square root so i will find it directly using the calculator so this is uh, 5 square plus 6 square plus 14 square so this gives us 16.03 16.03 now if i divide this 350 by 16.03 350 divided by answer so this is 21.832 so this is we can write it is 21.832 and now if i multiply and this with each and every component so we will get the cartesian vector of the force from b to a so f b a cartesian vector is equal to so we need to multiply 21.832 with with minus 5 so this is minus 109.16 minus 109.16 i plus then we need to multiply it by 6 130.992 so 130.99 j and then multiply by 14 so this is 305.65 plus 305.65 k and remember that the units are in pounds so this is the cartesian vector representation of the force from b to a similarly we can find f c a so f c a will be equal to again its magnitude so its magnitude is 500 pounds so magnitude times the unit vector from c to a and similarly the unit vector will be again equal to r c a divided by its magnitude and this is 500 so again we need to reach that point a but this time from point c so to reach that uh, point a from point c first we need to move if i draw a line here 
so we need to move this distance this distance in the positive y direction and this distance is 3 feet right so I will write plus 3 j and once I reach here I need to move this distance and this is in the positive x direction and this distance is 3 feet so I will write uh, plus 3 i and then I need to move 14 feet in the positive k direction so this is plus 14 k and again we can find its magnitude so the magnitude will be 3 square plus 3 square plus 14 square under the square root so the <coughs> magnitude of uh, the position vector from c to a is 14.63 14.63 and if i divide this 500 by 14.63 so 500 divided by answer this is 34.179 so 34.179 So, F C A Cartesian vector equals to, so I need to multiply this with each and every component. So, 34.179 multiply by 3. So, this is 102.537 I and then again with the same 3. So, again we will have that plus 102.537 J and then with 14 so we will multiply it with 14 so this is 478.51 478.51 k and again the units are in pounds now we need to find that fda so fda again it will be equal to its magnitude so magnitude is 400 times the unit vector from d to a and again the unit vector is equal to the position vector from D to A divided by its magnitude so this is 400 from D to A so now we reach to now we need to reach that point A from D so first I will travel this small distance this is in the negative x and this small distance is 2 feet so I will write minus 2 i then we need to travel this much distance from here to here and this distance is 6 feet and that is in the negative j direction so I will write minus 6 j and then we need to travel 14 feet in the positive k direction so I will write plus 14 k and divided by its magnitude again we can find its magnitude so magnitude is 2 square plus 6 square plus 14 square so this gives us 15.36 and 400 this 400 divided by 400 divided by answer this gives us 26.04 so 26.04 into all these components so f d a 26.04 into 2 so 52.08 i minus this is multiplied by 6 156.24 j and then multiply by 14 so this is 364.56 so plus 364.56 k and this is plus into minus so here we have that minus right so the units are in pounds so these are the cartesian vectors of fba fca and fda that was required in the problem so this is the solution of this particular problem i hope you people would have understood the solution of this particular problem kindly subscribe my channel if you haven't subscribed it yet also like this video if you people want me to solve such more problems